Your liver can only process one standard drink per hour. And today I'm gonna to show you through science what you can do to speed up that process. But first, let's get this party, I mean process, started. So most people think that alcohol is toxic. And it's true, it's a little toxic, but when it's compared to acetaldehyde, that acetaldehyde is actually 20 times more toxic than alcohol is itself. If you have more than one drink per hour, then you're gonna have a buildup of acetaldehyde, which ultimately lead to more stress on your liver and can have you really feeling it the following day. But not only is that acetaldehyde bad for you in the short term, it's actually really bad for you in the long term as well. So rather than processing that alcohol and acetaldehyde normally, by using cheers, you'll be able to process that acetaldehyde and alcohol at a more efficient rate. But first, we need to know what a standard drink is. For beer, it's 12 ounces at 5% ABV. For wine, it's five ounces at 12% ABV. And for spirits, it's one and a half ounces at 40% ABV. And we must know that one standard drink contains 14 grams of alcohol. And when it gets processed in your liver through the enzyme ADH, that's when that alcohol starts to convert into acetaldehyde. And as you can see, it's not very appetizing. So you may want the alcohol because it helps you feel good, but you definitely don't want to be left with this acetaldehyde part. Then in your body, through the enzyme ALDH, your body's able to convert acetaldehyde into acetate, which you then just pee out and get it out of your system. But how can cheers help speed up the rate in which you clear and reduce acetaldehyde? Let me explain. Whenever you ingest your alcohol through the enzyme ADH, it's converted into acetaldehyde. But rather than waiting around on the enzyme ALDH, you can actually take an amino acid that's in cheers, L-cysteine, that will effectively help neutralize that acetaldehyde and overall reduce those acetaldehyde levels by forming a non-toxic compound called MTCA, which effectively neutralizes acetaldehyde and helps you clear it out of your system faster. So it's overall better for your liver and better for your health in general. There's also another special ingredient, a flavonoid called DHM, that can help speed up the rate at which the enzyme ALDH converts acetaldehyde into acetate. Through two distinct mechanisms of action, using DHM and L-cysteine, you will reduce your acetaldehyde levels and speed up the rate at which that acetaldehyde is cleared out of your system, ultimately leaving your system and helping you feel better the next day. But there's one more thing about DHM too. It actually reduces something called GABA rebound, which is that psychological sensation you feel the day after a fun night out. We have so much brain fog, where you're so restless, why you might be so irritable, or you're feeling so opposite from the night before. The DHM binds to the same brain receptors that alcohol binds to, the GABA receptors, to effectively reduce that rebound and help you feel better the next day. So if you take cheers, you can help get to the main reasons why you truly feel bad the day after drinking. And it's important to administer cheers at your highest BAC levels so that that DHM and L-cysteine can work their magic when you need it the most. In fact, our claim to fame, if you don't feel like you had half as many drinks the next morning when you wake up, then you can get your money back, no questions asked. We were seen on Shark Tank and have sold over 40 million doses of this right here. And we can be found in over 30,000 retail doors nationwide with packaging that looks like this in both drug and grocery and packaging that looks like this in convenience. But for the best value, you can grab it online today on the TikTok shop on our page, the website ran by Jeff Bezos, and it'll run you around three bucks a dose. So no matter if you're drinking wine, spirits, or beers, always remember to cheers.